ちはできるようだなこのベジータ様とやり合えるとはなかなかだ What's going on, guys? Everyone, Ghost here coming back at you with another awesome anime review video of the final season of Fruit Basket. I literally had every emotion in my body just swerving left and right, up and down, in every, every way possible. And I apologize for the Discord messages. They're going to keep popping up. I'm in a pretty active Discord, so I apologize. <laughs> um. I, I don't know what to say. This anime, to me, personally, from my experience of watching the entire 13 episodes and seeing what I saw and kind of reliving a lot of what happened in season one and two, seeing Toru's story and a lot of her past and a lot of her secrets and a lot of what she felt towards her father and all the family members that kind of treated her badly, except her grandfather, who was a loving, kind person who always was on her side. And tried to help her any way he could. I think, especially for me, someone that's been watching this anime for a long time, and and、uh, seeing that this anime got remastered to a s e n s e of more or less so redone and kind of re r e d i r e c t I don't think it was redirected, I think it was just done and created differently, and made it, the animation much more cleaner and better.、Um, and seeing what happened in season three, especially finding out the secret. Or, not even a secret, or finding out about, well, it, it really was a secret,、um, about the hat. That Kyo was going to get that hat from Toto's mom, who then Toto's mom knew Kyo as a child at the time that after her husband,、uh, Toto's dad, had passed away. Having found out, she had him to comfort her at the time. So he would go to. This spot where I guess they were doing construction, and he would visit her ever so often and they would talk. And then eventually, at some point, she mentioned her daughter to him. And then, what even caught me by surprise was that he was there that day that Toto's mom had passed away. And I think at some point, he wanted to help her, but the Zodiac prevented him from doing so, and he blamed himself for that. I honestly don't blame him. For what happened, because he really wanted to try to save her. But at the same time, I understand where he was coming from. And it was the most gut wrenching thing to do, whether reveal your secret or save someone's life. If if it were me, it, it, it might be the worst decision I'd ever have to make. But if it meant saving someone's life, yeah, obviously I would. But for him, it was revealing a secret that no one should know. And this is something that I don't think anyone should know about, and it should be kept a secret. And I felt so bad for him because he was trying to ask for Toto's forgiveness in some sense, if you guys remember the episodes. But this anime, all in all, seeing what happened and kind of figuring out the pieces together of what I expected from this anime, it literally carried the spring. All on its back and said, Come here, I'm gonna take you for a ride. I mean, this anime is definitely a, a very good anime. All three seasons were fantastic to me.、Um, the final season was the nail, hit the nail on the head, and it, and it just. It, it, I, I got more than I should have, if I really wanna be honest here. The only thing that kind of confused me is why did they skip all the way to her and kill being old? And not showing how a lot of everything that went down, especially her having children already and then having grandchildren out of nowhere. That's about the only thing that kind of caught me by surprise. I know that I, I, I kind of wanted to know why, but I really shouldn't really think about it too much. But then again, at the same time, it kind of led me to wonder what really went down and how, that, how did that all even occur. But I guess we can do that another time. So for this anime, I definitely think. It, it deserves its dues. So,、um, as per the rating, I'm going to definitely give it a 9.4. It was, you have to watch it. You have to watch all three seasons to understand what went down here and kind of what you are expecting to see. This, this anime is beautiful. I, I, I won't lie to you.、Uh, where would I even place this? Definitely a top 10 anime, 100%. Easily. It's a definite top 10 anime. For me personally, just the story driven. 
the character development, the overall backstory to a lot of what went down. It's kind of what you expect from any anime, but a lot of animes don't do that. But, um, yeah, let me know in the comments below how you feel about this anime. Let me know what were your favorite scenes, your favorite moments from Fruit Basket. Um, any of you guys that are my friends that watch the, the channel, please let me know in the comments below. I definitely would appreciate it, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, slap a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Here comes Ultra Instinct!